Hi everyone, my name is Allison Castiles and I'm a school-based occupational therapist from Kids Inclusive. Today for Wellness Wednesday, I'm going to demonstrate a simple strategy to support children with their transitions. This is referred to as the first then strategy. Um, I'll demonstrate it through a video and then following that, I'll provide some simple directions um, related to the principles for using it at home with your children. We're gonna do a little bit of work today, okay? And you helped me, you helped me by making these little pictures, right? So first, what are we gonna do? First, we're going to do some, what did you draw there? Printing. Printing, and then guess what we get to play with after? A tablet. Do you know what game you wanna play with on the tablet? Or something that you wanna show me? Is there Angry Birds on there? Yeah. Okay, so first, right, we're going to do printing and then we're going to... Why do we... I had... Oh, no, it's not fun. But do you want to try this side? Or do you want to color a little picture? Yes. Oh, good choice. Okay, so here's our marker. Uh, so, Nolan, I'm going to start our timer, okay? So we're going to do work for, like, almost a minute and then we get to play with the tablet. So I just started our timer. Now go? Yep, go for it. Don't rush or anything. Oh, no. I'm doing great. Oh, oh. Oh, what does that mean? So we finished our work. What did we get to do? So we did our printing, now we can. I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> now you're just gonna, yeah sure, finish that E. All right, so we're done our printing, now we can. The tablet. The tablet, all right, here you go buddy. Good work. Well, my language. So I hope you found the video useful and uh, maybe to summarize some of the kind of takeaway messages or the principles that are really necessary for successfully using this tool at home um, are really just ensuring you have the right materials. So in the video you can see that Nolan, he really just used some little post-it notes that in fact he helped create and children might like that too. Um, I find using the language and pairing it with a visual is really supportive for a lot of children. And it really kind of helps uh, the child, they're, they're held a bit more accountable to the, the material than they are maybe the adult's instruction. Sometimes that helps. Um, in schools and therapy settings, sometimes we'll use material like this, but it really isn't necessary if you don't have it at home. Um, the other important uh, principle to using the strategy is just ensuring that the item that they're working for, so in Nolan's case, the tablet, is something that is highly motivating for him. Um, and for children, that changes all the time. So sometimes, often, it could be a piece of technology, but um, perhaps another day it might be something else, uh, activity outside, the trampoline, um, and really you can determine that by often just asking the child or getting the child to demonstrate how they're able to demonstrate. Um, the important, another important kind of takeaway is ensuring that we're consistent. So if we ask a child to do a challenging thing, we consistently follow through by promising to, do, by giving them the thing that we've promised. Um, that way children learn to trust us and eventually it might make it easier to fade these things later on as they develop. Um, the kind of the final takeaway message is just um, implementing something simple like a timing measure so a little uh, kitchen timer works or, or there are a lot of free apps that you can download that provide a visual timer and this helps kids really understand the length of the task and when it's complete and um, often children they have a hard time conceptualizing uh, a daunting task. How long is it going to take them? And that can often result in some resistance as well. Um, so I hope uh, those little strategies were useful and uh, go to the Kids Inclusive website where you can learn more about different resources and videos that we've developed over this time of school closure. Thanks!